hello what's up guys come back with me and today in this video i'll show you how to make a piston animation using fusion 360 from autodex first of all what you need of course is the 3d model of our animation such as a piston connection road crankshaft pin piston and also the gear and the liner And to build the 3D model, you also need the two-dimension drawing of your model. You can just look up on the internet and try to model it or follow my model with looking on my tutorial video. Or you can just put the simply 3D model, it's up to you. After you have done modeling your 3D model, now what we need to do is define the connection for each of your components. like how you define the joint status from your gear into the crankshaft and all of your components into one object can move synchronously let's start from the bottom section crankshaft and gear have a revolute connection and we define our gear to the ground so that means this gear will be our limitation for our movement system and after the select fork connection rod and it covers and choose a rigid and that makes the connection rod into one object and after that define this connection rod into the crankshaft with a uh, with relation as a revolut after that we can select a pin piston and join it into the connection rod and for this components we define it as a slider and after that select the head, pist the head piston and join it into the pin piston and define this combination as a revolut after all that for the last combination we select the piston head and liner and choose the slider as their contact and when you finish now you can move all your components and they will move synchronously to each other and for animation you can just select one join right click and choose animate model and the program will show you your animation and your component or you can just move it manually it's up to you
so with this concept you can make animation for your mechanical design and helping you to understand better the system of how your designs work and maybe help you to give a more better presentation maybe for your homework project and anything else thank you for watching if this video really helped you you can like share and subscribe this channel for more tutorial video thank you guys and see you next time ciao